Yeah, not a lot. Mm. Not as much pressure as he was before. Yeah. There is? No. Oh. Fuck no. Okay, I'll take it. So we're working on our black western star, the one we brought up the other day. Philip, one of our employees, he went through, he did the engine oil, uh, did the filters, the fuel filters, went through, greased the whole thing. He still has to check the rear diffs and everything, make sure the oils are good in that. I had to work on the propeller back here. When we were at the end of the season last year, we noticed it wasn't spreading as wide. And uh, in the propeller system, it had a, Something plastic wrapped up behind it that was slowing it down. So the reason I got this cardboard stuck on the front window is when I'm welding, uh, the little sparks that come off every now and then, we found out the hard way that it will uh, splatter your front window and then you get little dents in it. So before I do that to this window, just decided to put some cardboard in. We'll get this uh, last little bit welded on here now. My friend JC here, he's back from college since uh, the coronavirus. Oh yeah, brother. So, he's got nothing better to do, so he decided to come over and help weld the, the shit tank up. Putting a whole new floor in it. Uh, we got that. The second pipe tacked on, right up top. We got our custom plates weld. JC welded the bottom, and I'll tell you, look at them beads. I mean, I feel like this is factory made. Professional right there. What do you got anything to say with that? No, no. <laughs> when you're good, you're good. Exactly. That's a good welder for you right there. Uh, Hire him. He's looking for a job, guys. Yeah. <laughs> In the diesel industry. Now your 700 viewers know that. <laughs> <laughs> Broken yet? Hopefully, it didn't break any hoses, but we'll see. Hopefully, it just pulled them out. Well, she's all good. JC's about to keep on going. Marcus is patrolling the excavator, but quick fix. Not much broke down. And shit happens, and we kell keep on rolling. Till the rest, or the, till the next breakdown, I guess. Got two trucks filling me up now. The trailer got loaded, unloaded in the uh, Bodco. He had a little bit left, so he's emptying out in me. The other truck showed up. I better stay back before they spray me with shit. Got another truck waiting. Getting her done. We'll have this field done today. Done. So we got lucky on that. What's then, that note saying your door, Jay? Oh, Josh. Then, uh... It says, push your shoes off the door, don't fucking enter. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> oh man, what was I saying? They always got a habit of going through the whole house with his boots on, so I put that in up. And I told him he didn't have to get his boots off, he was sleeping outside. I don't even know what I was saying, I'll think of it. This might be why we're not gonna finish this today. I did something like this. Guess what I did it. It's comfortable. No shirt. Oh, Christo. It was like a fucking sauna and it probably burnt you. Yeah. Hey, we're keeping this PG. I fucking peel skin. I just rolled the model. Yeah, like a hand probably because the Break sun tough. just reflects off everything.
I'm about two seconds into this job. I already, I already wish I didn't have to do it. I'm looking up here. I can't even get, uh, anyways, I gotta get not to this one, but that one. And the biggest problem of it all is I checked up here right away before starting and the O-ring fell out. So not only do I gotta get this stupid new hose up there, I gotta get this O-ring on there and hopefully sit in there while I screw on this new thing. Damn it. All right, let's try this. Little 12 row. Not big out south, but it's big around here. Can't really use much bigger with the fields. We're going out there. Whichever side. You can push it all the way over there. Easy. Jeez um. Don't say that. So today, um, we got. I'm working on the uh, 74, 95, and uh, this is actually the first problem we've ever had to this tractor since we owned it. But the brake uh, caliber system, not caliber, but uh, where the brakes work in there, this. Uh, Part right here it's leaking oil he is almost done filling the big box he's got the 12 foot grass set i think that window right there is 10 foot wide alone so they're big a lot of feed and be good for efforts so today we got our brand new 450 big m this thing's uh has seen zero field action the skid plates haven't been scraped at all i mean they have a little bit because we put it on the concrete but that is that she is shining so christoph just got that one d limb that you saw earlier so he's bringing it bringing it around Swings that around, and then Josh is cutting it to length. We are doing something a little bit different. Marcus, what are we doing today? Brush hogging the side of the load. Yeah, we're doing a little bit of brush hogging. Well, this is about 30 seconds after the other recording. Ferdy broke the double rake, but it will be a quick fix. Marcus, what's broken? Tire. <laughs> Nothing. Nothing. All right. Today we're doing some. AV wait a minute. Okay. All right. Well, today we are all manure because we finished third cut now. And uh, Marcus, what'd you do? Broke the ship pump. How'd you do that? And and the ship pump is broken now. He broke the the bolt snapped off. Well, what, what happened is the shear bolts broke. He gave her too much power. Well, we'll get those fixed. At the moment, I am uh, mowing seven miles an hour. I am not using presets right now because.
because to be honest, I don't know what speed to be mowing at because sometimes I'm mowing slow enough just so that I can stay sitting in the seat and I don't take air. And other times I can do 11 miles an hour, uh, 10, 11 miles an hour if it's smooth in certain spots, which it was more smooth over there. I this morning, we are working on that Bodco shit tank. Uh, I think two weeks ago. We had the axle snap. Oh. So we are now, we've been waiting for the new axle to come in. It was pretty much all rusted already, even though it's been going, so. We're just gonna pick it up with the payloader. Ready to lift this heavy bitch? So I got the new ball right here. Okay. Pretty much the same thing. So, we'll get that put in now. So, we got a little project that we got going on. Uh, Andreas wants a spear system, or just a spear with a crook and X for a uh, skid steer. Because we got some square bales coming. So, we got a couple spears here. We're gonna weld it on that 4x4 and just weld it on that plate. Quick connect plate. Well, let's see how he does all by himself. Because he can't see me from right here. Guiding it in. Whoa, whoa, down a little. You're hitting the raft. Yep, you're good. Don't want him to break him, but I guess, uh, gotta watch him a little bit. Yep, look at that. It's tight. Crone's uh, cab, a lot different from the bigger one that you'll see later. So to let the mower deck down, you obviously push that button, uh, push that down button, and they both come down at the same time. So we gotta open this fan up up. Right Alex? What'd you do wrong here? Huh? Triple rake. That's because the yeah, hire has gone to college. It only runs it. And uh, we're up here. Just laying the windrows out. And yes, I did stop mid windrow to get out and walk around the tractor. We got the new one on, or the spare one. Part two. This is definitely round two, but let's not break it. Because that on that piston right there I didn't know he was letting it down and it, it went quick we're gonna get this load pushed up I'm trying to do this while holding this camera and running my uh, controls I should just mount this somewhere Alex is down there. No big thing. She's all excited. Christoph's bringing sand. Kyle hopped in the 84. I'm pulling this back. We are taking this part off now. Gerhardt's driving the tractor there. And his friend's here from college. He's gonna help flip this out. And then this is gonna go on the ground. So we'll get these last bolts out. Giving her the beans. He's only moving like three, four miles an hour. He got cut some zip ties to see if we can find the leak. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah. Find it? No. Oh, that's useless. Wind's 
picking up again. Marcus, don't make a hole, please. It's taking a lot of people today. So I was wondering, last couple loads, I've noticed this side was spreading a little weird. I got something in my pipe. Hopefully, I can just pull it out. It's a piece of wood. Look at that. Barbecue. We got all the pizzas. Yep. But this time it's right <laughs> All right. left after this that one's still in there it's typically pretty quiet in here I gotta get all those tracks he's gonna try starting it now I don't want to take over. Not. You're gonna help him up. You're gonna have to help me out. He's dying. I can oh, co I can coach you through. Side to side. Don't worry, your daughter's coming. She's coming to help. Men learn the quick way to put them on over here. Call him light. He can put all four on at one shot. Uh, the Fright Shaker, the favorite truck on the fire, oh yeah. <laughs> Anyways, she shook herself apart at the looks of it. So pretty much this is the final result. We gotta go bring it up to the neighbors now for the drive through parade. I missed out on some prime content. Christoph's falling. He is in pain now. <laughs> I need to just keep the camera rolling. We are... That's how you remove brakes around here. <laughs>